Nice to see hey, you babe. again. You too. Oh. <laughs> oh. There it is. Adorable. Thank you. Aww. Aww. In Hollywood, I feel like women can sometimes get just portrayed as like good and bad and versus each other. But you you have like an interesting role in this. Do you feel like Hollywood sometimes just doesn't get relations like between women, right? I do, yeah. I mean, I think first of all, there's just not that many people writing movies about women. I mean, most movies are written by men and they're about men and or they're about, you know, a hot girl. Um, and so I think... Yeah, it's rare to see a movie like this where you have a, a full rounded character. I mean, Charlize is, is a real person and, and my character, you know, usually if there's a nice wife, it's it's boring, you know, and there's nothing to do and it's like, but, but with my character, you know, Diablo wrote this really, really well rounded person who's cool and is a teacher and is in a mom band and all these real cool things. Yeah. And I was going to say, now that you've been in mom band, um, are you going to take up drumming? I want to. I just, I need a band. Like, I, drumming by yourself is kind of weird, <laughs> yeah. you know? You can't, be a one, you can't be like a one-woman drum show. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so you're going to grab some people in, in, in uh, L.A. and maybe start up a band? I would. If I could find, some, you know, some other like-minded ladies. I mean, I was thinking maybe I could ask Diablo to be in a band with me because I think she plays something. She looks like she plays something. Yeah, maybe I'm just making it up because she <laughs> looks like she could be in a band. And there's a lot of, like, music moments from the 90s that come in, the fashion moments, the whole thing. Uh, did you did you have any kind of nostalgia for the 90s while you were shooting for this? Yeah, I mean, it reminded me of the music and the, the hairdos and the, the clothes. I mean, it's, it's, the 90s are a little more subtle, though, because they're, they're not that far off from where we are now, and yet very different. So I, I'm not sure if I've fully grasped the 90s yet. I, mm -hmm. I need a little more time. Some more reflection. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This film is a little bit about to bringing who you were in the 90s or bringing who you were in high school into your adulthood. Was there anything, any kind of remnants of, of high school that you brought into your role? No, I mean, because I was a really a bad girl in high school. So, <laughs> <laughs> What do you mean bad girl? I mean, I didn't go to school. I would just, you know, jack off, like, you know, run, run away and not go to school and come home at 4 in the morning and... Uh, I was a real troubled kid, and I, you know, put my parents through hell. So I don't, <laughs> I did not draw on that for, for Beth. In fact, I thought Beth must have been really cool in high school, like one of those people that, you know, does everything and is nice to everybody. And you know. In this role, you're very nurturing and seem really happy, and also with your role in, in Twilight, um, you, you kind of, you know, you, you're holding down the fort kind of thing. That, mm -hmm. that comes pretty naturally, huh? I know, and I don't understand this because I'm not a mother in real life and I'm not even married, so it's funny. I think it's just my face or something or I seem nice. I, I don't know why I, I get these roles, but I'll take it. 